The Marshall Center has been in uh, Garmisch now for 23 years. And uh, five years ago, largely due to the efforts of Dr. Roloff, I must admit, uh, we had this, this idea that we would be able to offer to our international participants at the Marshall Center uh, a master's degree program which complied with all of the requirements of the Bologna process for the European Union, but would also be acceptable to the United States as an accredited program as well. And I can't express too much how grateful we are that the Bundeswehr University was willing to do this effort with us. We have graduated, uh, how many now? Over 40 now, I think, uh, people through this particular program. And what's really unique about it is that a participant in this program, unlike going to a normal university and getting a master's degree where it's all academic, the individual in this program also is exposed to international participants from all over the world. So it is a very unique opportunity, not only for us at the Marshall Center, but for anybody who enters the program. And we're extremely proud of this. I was telling Dr. Nevis, uh, we are the only regional center that the United States has that uh, has such a program. Uh, and that is quite an accomplishment in itself. So uh, it is with great enthusiasm, I think, that I will sign this particular memorandum of understanding. And I'm delighted that uh, people could come here from the Marshall Center. I would point out we have in attendance today two of the Two of you, Gil, and I'm sorry, I don't know your name, but no problem, sorry, Oliver. Oliver, thank you for coming. Two students who are currently enrolled in the program. And uh, if you want to see what the future of international security and international relations are, look at these two, these two young men and what they're going to achieve. So it's wonderful to have you both here as well. And uh, that's enough of my speaking. Yes. Okay. Thank you very much. Uh -huh. So, uh, Mr. So, Alzani. Okay. I was really excited when I found out that their opportunity existed to attend the master's degree program in Germany. I could have picked any number of schools in the U.S., but I really wanted to have an opportunity to have an international student body. One of the best things about having an international student body here at the MISS program is the opportunity to make relationships with people from all over the world. In my classes, I've had students from the Ukraine, from Georgia, uh, places like this that have helped me understand sort of the, the conflicts and the current events that are going on in the region. Many, many people with different backgrounds uh, come together and we could share opinions, which sometimes differ a lot. People from interior, people from justice, from police, look differently at things than military do. That is a quite a good experience. For my master's thesis, I chose to study Morocco. Uh, fortunately, my next assignment, I already know, is going to be at the embassy in Morocco, so I thought this was an excellent opportunity to, to get in depth. Uh, I've been in the program since uh, 1st of September last year. As it was recommended to me, I, I've chosen the uh, Seminar on Regional Security because that is, um, the, I would say, the most important things for uh, military personnel. As General Dayton mentioned, uh, it is a program for people from all continents. That is one important thing. But also the location in Garmisch. Um, everybody lives there for almost one year. You can build relationships up to friendship which extend uh, the status of just being studying together. That is very important and I think uh, some friendships uh, will uh, stay for life, yes.